Okay, Mike here at Sky Include, keeping you included into the sky as always. <laughs> uh, and this finally arrived. Uh, Matt Zipkin has been chatting to me, as you know, and we're working. He did, him and a few other contributors in the community did a lot of work to make uh, the Ledger integration with Handshake. And he knows I do these videos, and we've been working together. I bought one and sent to him, and he sent it to me in China. It took forever <laughs> i was actually scared it would even reach me because it's crypto in china you know <laughs> anyways so i got my i set it up already okay i'm not going to show you my seed phrase on the other side i'm not going to teach you how to set up ledger i'm assuming you could find the guides ledger.com slash start etc etc this video is specifically for ledger for handshake hns and i just did it Myself and he, he there's a little bit of kind of hiccups I had and Matt even helped me over the weekend here in mid-August 2021 So we take what I learned. I got it plugged in. I got it installed Etc So it's here the clear one And handshake is installed already. I already did a test setup wallet with Bob, but I'm gonna do another one now just to show you So let's do this. All right, let's pop on around here my all this stuff so it works with Bob wallet right now so you download it if you don't have it already uh, I already of course have it I have some some videos at skyinclude.com slash Bob wallet for you to check out so we're here okay but actually first we gotta install it so after you set up your ledger I'm gonna set up my pin right now give me one second okay so we're here so Hopefully you won't need to do what I have to do here, but if if you do, you're I'm following the guides, of course. Make another video, sorry. Just check out the uh, Niami one just made. So there's a guide here for Bob Wallet and Ledger table of contents. One thing I missed was this notice at the top. You have to turn on developer mode first. Okay, so then Matt made another one here. You have to enable developer mode. Okay. So hopefully my video can help. Uh, because I, I didn't see that until he told me. So you go into manage. Actually, first, developer mode is in this settings. Experimental. And I turned on developer mode already. Save, you know, of course, do your own risk. But unfortunately, the Ledger's app is not approved. The Handshake one yet. Uh, hopefully, maybe by the time you watch this, you don't need to do that. Okay, so it's got to allow it, you know. So I push both buttons. And see, I already have Handshake installed. I hope you can see that. So it's just loading. Um, but if you didn't have it installed, Handshake is already installed. See that version 1.0.5. Good job. This community is awesome. All right. So I have it installed on my Ledger Nano S. And I have, so it's, it's running. All right, so let's talk about how to set it up. So create new wallet, although I already did this, but I'm just going to show you these steps. Connect to Ledger, accept terms, uh, Ledger. I'm not going to actually. OK, I just. So actually, I don't think you have more than one per computer, but you would click connect. It should work. If it doesn't work, which happened to me, you got to actually uh, double click when you see the handshake. And then it will say pending ledger review. I hope this is clear. You click it again. And then it will go to use wallet. And then you click the connect to ledger. Okay. So let's keep going. I hope I'm helpful. I'm not, I'm not going to set up a new one because I think I only have one. Return to login. So you'll see I have one that says ledger, okay? Okay, so I'm in. I didn't actually send funds yet. You're brand new for me. Um, but basically the point of this is you don't need the ledger until you actually make a transaction outgoing, sending out money. Receiving money, there's some joke on the internet, some woman, some 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 banking expert thinks you have to have your wallet on to receive Bitcoin or crypto. <laughs> so that's like uh, showing you how much these politicians or old people know about crypto. You don't have to have this on. You can receive money, h and uh, anytime, 24 hours a day, seven days a week. Um, 
I'm not going to go into that story. But you only need the ledger when you're sending HNS or making a bid. So essentially, when you're when you're um, if you were to send something, I don't know if, if I can't right now. You would just need to authorize it on the ledger, okay? By you know double clicking the buttons. Um, I hope this is helpful, but essentially you don't have also another note. You don't have your seed phrase for Bob wallet. Your seed phrase is on your nano, right? So restoring it would be on nano and then you connect because you're only logging in, right? You're in the ledger wallet. You're not in a native Bob wallet wallet. Okay. So I might do a second video, but this is the setting up and installation of the wallet with ledger so this is my any hns or names would be on the on my ledger with that private key not with bob's private key so you're essentially instead of using bob wallet's private key you're using ledger so i hope this is making sense i don't have hns in this account so of course i can send it to myself or others can send here once i have it here for me to send it out i would need to authorize it on my ledger app or ledger wallet okay i hope that makes sense again we'll put this on skyinclude.com slash ledger and then other videos or other tutorials or other updates as we go we'll keep that page as updated as we can thank you so much again this is pretty awesome thanks uh team for that bye bye